So I had to make a cut com again because my sensitivity is wrong. Well, that's not the reason, but the last cut com I uploaded was on my uh, other channel and it got a lot of love. So why not make another one? What the fuck are you doing? You just seen you just seen me fly then. I see fire. Fuck off, I'm so shit. I didn't pull out a fucking pistol on you, did I? Fuck, oh my god. He pulls out his pistol every fucking time. I've been uh, watching a lot of Jeremy Kyle recently and um, a few Americans. You don't know what that is? And I am so sorry. Because it's the fucking greatest thing ever. So basically, what the Jeremy Kyle is, it's this guy and he's like, he's, he's sort of like cocky, but he's good at the same time. It's sort of like the Jerry Springer show if you've ever seen that but it, there's like no fighting. It's all about like liars and stuff and he gets people on and then they've been cheating on their, their wife, husband or whatever the fuck it is. And they do like lie detectors and DNA tests and shit but some of them are like really fucked up and it doesn't have to be all about cheating or anything. Like this one I watched a couple of weeks ago there was a grandma and then her husband died not so long ago so she had like pictures of him and the pictures obviously meant a lot because her husband has died. Pictures of her husband of course, not nudes. She couldn't find the camera and she thinks one of her children has stolen it because they both have like records of stealing from the family and stuff. So they needed to do a lie detector to find out which son stole the camera and Jeremy Carr was getting all pissed off like one of you is a stole the fucking camera! I can't show you. I can't explain. But sometimes crazy shit happens. You know Americans have like gangsters and shit and they live in the hood and they're like, yeah, what's up, man? In Britain, we don't have like gangsters. We probably do like down south or something. But where I live, we've got these things called chavs. And what chavs are is they wear like really retarded shit. They wear tracksuit bottoms with Adidas or Adidas. They wear big socks and they tuck the socks into the bottom of the, um, the tracksuit bottoms. And uh, they usually like, they're really skinny and stuff and they, they think they're rock hard. They take drugs, the, the drug dealers, and, and all this shit. And tons of them go into the Jeremy Kyle show. And I don't know if you have this in America, but we have this thing called the Dole. When we get paid, I think like 5% of our wage goes towards taxes or some shit like that. And it's for the people who don't have jobs, so we can help them. And what the benefit people do, the Doles, they live off of our taxes, they don't have a job, and they get like four kids. Because when you have a kid, you get a bit more money so you can pay for the kid. And they get as much kids as they can, just so they get more money. So they can buy their drugs, they can buy their alcohol and stuff like that. That's what chavs do. And the Jeremy Kyle show is full of them. Jeremy Kyle's bodyguards are like absolutely fucking huge. And sometimes the chavs are like absolute dickheads and they think they can take on the bodyguards and stuff. Here's a clip of... An example of that. See, the Jeremy Cow show is full of that, and you guys don't get that. I'm gonna link a channel in the description that I've subscribed to, and he basically just uploads like two Jeremy Kyle episodes a day, and he cuts out all the advertisements and shit like that, and the intros, and he just keeps in the main part, and it's so fucking good. If you guys are interested, make sure you go and like check him out. It's so fucking hilarious. That's like that's my cook on. If you want to see more cook ons, make sure you just like tell me. They'll be just like this. Hope it's been alright. Peace.